name's Anthony. I live in Gainesville, Texas. My son Anthony is a member of Superior Health Plan. He is an awesome little fella. He's basically your average little boy. He got diagnosed with severe allergies and asthma. It kind of was life altering because we were in the emergency room at least once a month, um, sometimes twice a month. I felt completely helpless. I felt like I couldn't do anything for my, my son that, like, what was I doing wrong? Why couldn't, you know, I get his health under control? I really didn't get a lot of sleep then. Probably a couple hours a night. That went on for about a year um, because I, I just was scared something would happen to my baby. Who's to say? My son could have had an asthma attack that he didn't come back from, or we could have took him to the doctor and his oxygen was too low to get back up. The first time that I spoke with Andrea, I noticed that she was significantly overwhelmed with everything going on in her life, especially regarding Anthony's health. We couldn't go places because people had animals and only certain people could come around and can't have on cat fur and dog fur. It was just a lot. I could hear the stress that she was having, the frequent ER visits, the multiple doses of prednisone that he had been on, constantly going to the doctors and being on antibiotics. The first time I, I spoke with, with Shay, I was skeptical. I didn't think, think she would be able to help me. Um, I didn't know what she would be able to do for me. When I couldn't breathe, I was sad. Andrea really needed help with navigating the healthcare system. When I started to really correlate the snoring, the strep throat, his ears were constantly hurting, I strongly encouraged her to ask for an ENT referral because the symptoms that he was having were way too frequent and there had to be something else going on. I felt a little optimism, you know? I'm like, maybe this lady knows what she's talking about. She was knowledgeable. She, she just had all the resources and she just knew her job and she knew it well. I could appreciate that. When I found out from the ear, nose, and throat doctor that a lot of his issues were due to the fact that he needed to get those tonsils and adenoids removed. That's why he was having a sleep apnea. That's why he would stop breathing in his sleep. I follow up with mom about a month after and just the joy and hope that I could hear in her voice. It was almost like he was reborn. Yes, it was almost like he was a new child. He plays soccer now with his friends. I mean, like, can you believe that? Like, <laughs> When you feel hopeless that you can't help your child, you want someone that has your back. Without Shay and Superior Hope Plan, um, I would just, I would still be lost. <laughs>